Hi, I'm Mr. Eric Tang. If I say one plus one does not equal two in Python, how do you think? Of course, it's possible. So, when does one plus one not equal two in Python? I would like you to think and do some exploration in this line first if you want to learn better. Now, please pause your video here to think and then try the code in Python. Hey, what are you waiting for? Pause your video now. Good. Now it's another exploration. Think about the result and try to execute the code here in Python. Hey, believe me, it's good for you. Here is the answer of exploration 1. Since the data in A and B are integers, when we add them together, it just lies the normal calculations. Hence, 1 plus 2 is 3. However, since C and D are string, when we add the letter 1 and letter 2 together, Python will treat it as the concatenation of two strings together. And the result is 1, 2. Please note that when I said 1, 2, it means two letters put in together. It's still a string. But if I said 12, I refer to an integer. Here you can see, you will get an error when we try to add an integer and string together. Now, for exploration 2, you can see A in this time is an integer, while B is a floating point number. If we add them together, the resulting data will become a floating point number. It makes sense. Here comes to a conclusion. From the above exploration, we know that knowing the data type is very important in Python, especially when we are dealing with variables. Since the results of the operation depend on the data types. That's enough for today. Goodbye.